I have this small square. And I'm going to make a golden rectangle from this. So this is one inch square. Okay. So if I have this, in order to make a golden rectangle, you just mark the exact center here, which is a half inch, right? Then So this is a half inch, but if you connect this corner, I mean this half inch and the corner like this, and using compass, this length can be coming to this side. And if you extend now, this is golden rectangle. So the ratio is one point one point six one eight. Okay, so that's the uh, ratio of golden rectangle. Now it's interesting, if you make this ratio of golden rectangle, like one and 1.618, you notice that you can have this So this is 1.618. If you make this square here, now this entire thing is bigger golden rectangle means this is one and this is 1.618. It's a magical number. If you do this one and 1.618, that ratio can continue. Now this become one, six, uh, one and this is 1.618. Okay, and now you notice that this is now 2.618, right? And if you make another square here, this is Now, this is another golden rectangle. If this is one, this is 1.618. And this continues. Now this, you make a square by this long side here. Now close to four and quarter. This is another golden rectangle. 
and now it's close to seven. This is another golden rectangle. Okay, so this is the magic number that everything become golden rectangle. If I keep talking about this compass here, this is how I started, right? And now I can start to think about this to be Ah, my compass is not big enough. Okay, so, and if you follow this curve here, that curvature applies to many things, like uh, how uh, like a flowers bloom, how galaxy is formulating, everything follows this curvature. So this one really tells us a golden rectangle is uh, applying to everywhere in the universe from a microscope level to a very big uh, scale as universe, okay? And that's the background uh, information about golden rectangle and that's something we're gonna use for the, our design.